Hello everybody, how are you all? This is Karthik Puvan, I'm a leadership coach and author and I am just amidst a very, very lush green forest. And this time I have entered even more deep, very, very deep. And I'm going to go right across and have a nice drive. Let me just open the windshield and feel and overlook the trees. I feel the trees are overlooking me from the top and you know, it's like such a great experience. Let me show you how the road looks like ahead. Can you see that? I'm gonna be entering this lush green environment. Absolutely amazing. And uh, how, how do you feel? What a beauty. And now it looks even more wonderful. Gracious. Just observing the nature, the music of the birds. And not forgetting the name of the divine. J J J J J J J J J Balaji. I keep chanting this. Powerful. Absolutely amazing. Look, what a beautiful uh, view from the back mirror as well. And uh, connecting to this form of Lord Balaji all the time. The relationship between a devotee and the Lord is filled with a lot of love. And this love is many a times missing. And that is where people don't get to invest the necessary time and energy in beautiful and amazing spaces. Look at this. Absolutely brilliant. Can you see that, folks? Amazing. And uh, it's a great experience to be able to witness the presence, to witness the joy, and to witness the freshness that surrounds in these spaces. Magnificent. brilliant can I just describe in words see the view a perfect jungle safari I can call this and experiencing the jungles all alone is incredible experience especially when you're all by yourself and taking a drive and feeling the pulse and the rhythm and the joy that surrounds this possibility is really really amazing Everywhere it's filled with greenery. Absolutely. Look at that. Whoa. Beauty. Let me just lower the window and show you how it looks like. I do as I 
keep a little safe distance and then I sit down and I start just gazing the nature there's nothing else to do just be here observe the nature feel the freshness is surrounding and uh, look at this uh, that's what i like about the rare mirror oh beauty what a beauty and uh, and the side mirrors also show some really really amazing view it's a great experience what an amazing experience so there's always an indication, you know, that you get from the nature. There's always an indication that you get from the wild animals. And if you pay total attention to the indication, you can be very careful and you can protect yourself from any mishap that happens. I've been like a keen observer and I've been going to the jungles quite a lot. I've been going to the Himalayas. I've been going to the oceans. And I've been a man of mountains, jungles and oceans. It's like so awesome. I cannot just describe in words. The beauty, you know, the beauty especially that surrounds these spaces is not something that I can... You just got to be a little cautious, that's all, you know. Because it's a very, very wild jungle and you've got to respect the laws of the jungle. You cannot be arrogant here. You cannot say, hey, listen, I know this person, I know that person. I am the minister, I am the DGP, I am the collector. I am so, I am a great businessman, I'm a billionaire. I own such a big multinational company. You, the, the forest gives a damn about it. That's the beauty of this forest. It just goes by the laws of the nature. And as a human being, you have the greatest possibility to connect consciously with grace and experience the flow of life, connectedness of life. Feel the rhythm of life. Feel the pulse of life. Feel the joy of living. And you can once and for all be free from the deep hypnotic patterns which are set by the society to make you feel bad for thinking in terms of living a joyful life, for living a life filled in devotion. Today, when you speak about devotion, people make fun of a lot of people. That's because unfortunately, the benefits of devotion are never ever felt. And even the benefits of the material are not being felt by a majority of the population. Look at the planet. Majority of the planet is living in poverty, adverse poverty. Now somewhere I feel there is a disconnection between man, woman and nature. People have stopped thinking for themselves. People have stopped prioritizing what is it that they want. When I am in these places, I feel so intoxicated, you see, my eyes. And uh, they just release dopamine, you know. I'm, I'm just feeling the joy. And just by observing the nature, I'm feeling like this. I want you to observe the nature for a minute. Take a minute and observe the nature. How do you feel? I was in a very deep state and I usually keep that deep state to myself. And it's lovely tears of joy and ecstasy. 
I feel blessed because every day in the morning my eyes, my cheeks get rubbed by tears of joy. It's an incredible experience. It cannot just be described in words. Let me show you how it appears when you are totally gazing. How do you feel? Just see this place. <clears throat> I can sit here and keep observing the nature. What a beauty. And I sometimes just get down, but keep a safe distance uh, when you are very deep inside the forest. Absolutely amazing. Look at this view. Especially that fresh flow of prana that goes inside is like so amazing. You cannot act as if, you know, though you come here many times, you know, when I come here many times, I understand time frames and uh, move only as much as you are allowed because there is a silent language always communicated. You need to go in. So there was this monkeys, you know, and they just indicate if they spot some leopards or tigers very far away and they just indicate you. You just have to be aware. I sit like this for some time, hours together. And I had just paused the video for some time here. I was gazing the forest. It was so amazing, refreshing. Now I'm going to go ahead and experience more wonderful and uh, more joyful views everywhere around me. What a beauty. Look at this. Going through the forest is a luxurious experience. Absolutely amazing. This is true jungle drive. Very thick jungles. Got to be careful, got to be cautious, got to approach it with a lot of dignity and care. The forests are only getting thicker and thicker. Everywhere around, if you can see. Just lower the window. Absolutely amazing. What I enjoy in these spaces, the calm, pleasant serenity, and an emergence of something 
that just cannot be just described in words it's a nourishment to the soul wow it's more forest i can just show you how it appears like that beautiful absolutely amazing How beautiful. What a beauty. Gracious. Amazing. And you can see the forests are only getting thicker and thicker and thicker. Vibrant. It is so vibrant here. Jungles are awesome. Everywhere there is lot and lot of energy and I'll be here for some time I'm getting down but being close to the car and feeling the pulse of the forest so I will pause the video for a second now here maybe for an elegant start recording maybe after 20 minutes because it's a great time to just get out Right, I'll see you. And from the last 20 minutes, I was just going inside. I sat there and I've just come back. It's so nice to experience this vibe here. Absolutely amazing vibe. And my car also feels very, very refreshed to be able to witness this divine forest, absolutely gracious, so much filled with greenery, serenity, and there's a vibe that cannot just be described in words. Just have to be careful whether there are some snakes or not on the down so that I don't end up hurting them. It's important. As far as life is concerned, we appreciate life with a lot of grace, with a lot of calmness, 
with a lot of gratitude because it is a great experience to feel good is a great experience unfortunately these are the things that are never ever shared by the society never ever shared by the people there is always only priority towards okay if you have achieved something in life oh have you achieved a car have you achieved a, a house have you scored marks only these things but never ever priority has ever been given to joyful living never ever priority has been given to nature grazing to be able to sit like this to be able to uh, think about the conscious choices we are making in our day to day life what kind of activities empower us to have joyful and harmonious conversations where you are not being judged where you've been totally accepted it's nourishment for the soul it's nourishment for the body it's nourishment for the being and unfortunately a majority of the humanity is missing this big time and that is where you have so much of stress in the world constantly people are seeking approval for our from others because somewhere there is an inherent dominant thought process which is governing every human being to be included and to be accepted to be included and to be accepted and to be respected to be included to be accepted and to be respected today in the society you have to work a lot you have to achieve what the society has set as a standard frame of success and then you will gain the appreciation of others but in this trade you lose yourself totally you will not have any time for yourself so associate with uh, wonderful people who accept you for being alive who connect with you with love who feel that you being alive is good start appreciating this let me pause a video for a second and show you a view i'm going to pause and observe the nature because i just felt there's a deep calling in the woods so i'm just going to get down and feel the pulse and i will again talk to you back but just think about this point i want you to also pause the video and think about these points that i just said so i had a great time here hope you also had a good time did you observe about what i asked you to observe did you think about what i just asked you to think is it not great is it not wonderful to have people in your life with whom you can have harmonious communication never ever in the history has such things be ever rewarded respected never and this is the harsh truth of the reality where people have not started respecting one another because they are alive and this is costing enormous pain in the world 
and somewhere if you do not attend to this reality then in many ways it's going to be a very sad world so i will be going ahead and i will be taking a drive i'll be pausing the video here i'll be connecting back maybe after one or two hours but uh, it's great because you know we will have a single video happening but i'll be spending here some hours together and uh, i'll keep pausing the video and again replay again start play recording it after some time that's a great feature in this so that the conversations can be so connected it's so amazing so i'll see you after on an hour i've been like taking a walk and just come back near my car and it's such a great experience tranquil serene very very vibrant absolutely well, you see you need to be careful look at this I'll show you it's a very very poisonous spider I was just entering and was very careful Sometimes you just have to observe this, otherwise you will miss out. It's a great experience to be here, to be witnessing this grand space. I'm also blessed to be able to invest the necessary time and energy in these spaces. What a vibrant time this is. What a vibrant space. Absolutely amazing. Serene. Just got to be at a safe distance. That's all. Look at these jokes. And to be able to be here for hours together is like a great experience. It's, it's a very blessed experience to be blessed by the harmonious trees, to be blessed by great oxygen, and to also witness. Look at that. Wow. Beautiful. No, you have you spotted anything here? Have you spotted it? This is exactly how our eyes also work sometimes. Until we zoom and focus. Can you see that? Let me come from the around and show you. Now look at this. Its nest is so vast the way it has stitched the way it appears Whoa.
go be careful. The chances are it might bounce. Amazing. Look at its claws. As if it's, it can penetrate very deep. And it's such a wonderful time to be driving in the forest. This is like true jungle safari. And my car feels very, very gracious to be able to be witnessing this absolutely amazing time here. Fantastic. Brilliant. So I'll be taking a walk a little more longer. And uh, now it's very, very safe. And uh, now I have got attuned to these energies here. And now I feel very, very safe and protected. And now I will be venturing in. Good day, everybody. Have a wonderful time. And I'll join you maybe after some two to three hours. And it's going to be really, really wonderful here. It's gracious. Good day.